Hey guys, what's happening? So today is just like a quick video and um, basically to show you guys how to uh, get more money on Pokemon Sword and Shield. So this is like a really, really quick and easy method of how to do it. It is really, really simple. Anyone can do it. Uh, depending on what part you are in the game though, it will depend on how fast it is that you do it. So if you've already completed the game and you're allowed to get 2000 watts every time that you uh, click on a, a den that's got a beam on it, then you are going to get... Uh, money a lot faster than other people if you've just started out you will only be getting a couple of hundred watts per den and then that means it'll take a little bit longer but basically what you got to do is is this trick so you throw a wishing piece into the den to start with so it has to be a one that you've throw, throw, thrown a wishing piece into not a one that already had a beam so what you're going to do is go over to it and you're going to click invite others wait for that to come up then click the home button go all the way to the settings all the way down the bottom and then to date and time and then you're going to click this off click on date and time skip ahead by one day click ok go back to the game and then click quit come off of it and then what you're going to do is you're going to click back onto it and then this time you will get 2000 watts so you'll see i've been doing this for a little while i've got 111,000 watts now so what you're going to do is after you've got the right amount of watts you're going to go oops you're going to go to the guy that you buy, yeah, you spend your watts on. So I'm going to come out of the, the tundra, and I'm going to go up to here to Hammerlock Hills. And then basically, all you're going to have to, all you're going to do is you're just going to go over to this guy, and then you're going to buy whatever pokeballs he's got to so go and spend my watts. So he's got netballs today. You're going to click on that. You're then going to get 998. I've already got one in my in my bag. So we basically need about 50,000 watts, so once you've got 50,000 watts you can stop doing the watt farming on the den and then buy 999 balls or, or any that you need for how much money you want. Because basically what you're going to do is you're going to go to town, then it's going to go to the closest Pokemon Center, and then you're going to go to the market inside and you're going to sell these Pokeballs that you've just bought. And each of these actually goes for... 500 Pokemon coins. So every time that you get 999 of them, you are able to sell them for just under half a million. So we're going to go down to the netballs that we've just done. It's 500. There you go. 499,500 Pokemon coins. So now I've adds that to the one and a half million I already had. Now I've got 2.1 million Pokemon coins. And then that is basically the quickest and easiest way of doing it. So if you do need to get 50,000 watts before you can do this, do the method I showed you at the start. Just keep doing it over and over and over again. If you've managed to get far enough in the game so that you get 2,000 watts each time, then you will do it in about maybe of 30 goes and you'll get enough to exchange it for half a million. If you want more than that, then just keep going or have a much that you want. And if you are just starting out and you've only got to get in a couple of hundred, for each uh, wish, for each time you do it, it will take you longer. But if you have one, just start out, and you probably won't need as much money straight away as what you do later on. So you won't need to do it for as long as you want. So it's basically every time that you do it, it's 50 watt pieces for one ball, and that one ball gets you 500. So just work out how much you need, and then once you get that amount, buy the amount that you need, and then sell them. You can always come back and get more if you need to, because you can do this infinite amount of times. Every time you do it, uh, you, you can get a thousand at a time. Obviously, you've seen there that I had over a hundred thousand watts. I could go back and get another five hundred thousand if I wanted to, if I needed more than the five hundred thousand that I just had. But anyways, guys, that is it for this video. It's just a quick, uh, quick run through of how to get money on Sword and Shield. It's super, super easy. Just make sure that you uh, do the watts uh, farming and then sell it. It's pretty simple if you if you're unsure. Just go back in the video, watch the video through again, so you know exactly how to do it. But anyways, guys, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.